So I'm watching Vampire Night, if you can't already tell. And I'm actually really liking the show, which I should pause to not do more things. But anyways, uh, hello everybody, welcome to Jan July, was it January? Yeah, January, everybody. Welcome to July 6, 2014. I'm exceeding Shadow Sunday, by the way. Uh, in the bathroom. And, uh... I'm like, I'm watching Vampire Night, which I'm actually liking Vampire Night so much, I'm on episode 7 of Vampire Night, and I think I was starting to watch this anime on Friday, and I only watched like one episode on Friday, and Saturday came, I only watched another one, Sunday, today, I watched all of them, well, well from this point on, I'm watching 7 now, so I watched a total of 4 episodes? Four and, and if there's a vibration, yeah, someone's texting me. By the way, so yeah, I'm actually liking Vampire Nights. Actually, really, like in a romantic, action pack kind of vampire Halloweenish kind of thing. What I like, I like animes then when they're kind of creepy. Something well, not too creepy, but in a creepy Halloweenish, awesome kind of fantasy love romance action pack kind of thing. And I just basically just explained Soul Eater to you guys, and I <laughs> so Soul Eaters. But vampires, basically. But anyways, um, I'm actually really liking the anime. It's actually pretty good. Um, uh, thank God for curiosity for myself, because I actually just decided to watch it because the name itself and it looked pretty cool. Vampire Night on the title of the cover and all that stuff. So, and this description of Netflix for once actually got me into something I wanted to read. But anyways, uh, yeah, Vampire Night's actually pretty good. But uh, today I want to talk about that I've been. Really, been actually, what have I doing? Oh, I've just been editing on those videos that I recorded yesterday, and I'm, I finished editing them like around morning and or afternoonish. And ever since I was done editing them, I started uploading them. But I forgot how shitty the upload on my internet has been for like the last couple months. That they're taking forever, and some of the demos aren't even that long. They're like five minutes, and it's taking forever. And and the quality of the video is not even like HD or nothing. They're just mobile, like what, what size? They're like 480 or 360 by some duration, but they're not a big file. They're like small kind of files compressed from HD things, but. They're not even that long, and they're taking a long time to upload. I, I left it uploading like, what was it? like three or something, and I left to Walmart, which I did, and I bought uh, two bags of chips. I bought hot cheeto fries and uh, Takis Nitro. Uh, if you don't know what Takis is, it's basically a ja uh, not Japanese, it's a Japanese version, <laughs> a Mexican version of uh, hot Cheetos, but tortillas is wrapped around in a weird cool way but it's it's been really really big here in north america as a recent year or two and it's i'm now seeing them in like walmarts and smiths which is really awesome and now there's like a hot cheetos combo pack kind of mix thing like hot cheetos with takis mixture and one bag and I, I haven't bought that yet but i really want to buy one make me think of it i want to eat one but but um uh yeah so that's happened so, what was I talking about? Okay, so I've been uploading them all day, and they're still uploading. Um, that's been really it the whole freaking time. Like, no joke, it's been, that's been really the whole freaking time. Uh, but, bef but the whole time when I was editing and uploading them, I was trying to kill time and watching actually some movies and shows that I've been wanting to watch. So, I watched, I think, two or three movies and Vampire Night. So, I've seen today alone. I seen Clueless, the movie. A uh, movie which is about a girl being popular in high school. It was something I kind of somewhat watched when I was a kid. Um, I used to really watch it. I remember that. Um, the guy from Sh Scrubs is from there. Uh, the black guy, I can't remember his name. But he's on this uh, movie and a couple other familiar actors that's famous now are on the movie too when they're kind of preteen kind of movies. So it was one of those movies as their younger age kind of sells, which it, it didn't age bad. It's actually pretty good in lots of ways because a lot of things are still the same since that thing, other than some of the words they've been saying, like. I don't know what to say. But like, whatever is the hottest trending word to say at that time, that they said like maybe a 
two or three, four times in the movie. That's really it. And it doesn't really bother me at all because it doesn't at all. But Clues is still pretty a good movie, but it's about a girl that's literally, well, clueless about life and she thought she knew everything at the beginning of the movie, but then she started learning more things about herself and friends and other people that she actually became not clueless at the end of the movie. And that's basically what happened. And what the fuck is that? Uh, I see a bug, and it's actually a really weird bug, because I've never seen that bug before. Okay, it's a really weird bug. And no worries, that's a scary bug, and hopefully not, but it was a weird bug in general. Anyways, um, I know where it is. <laughs> Don't worry. Um, anyways, what was I saying? Okay. So, what else did I watch today? I saw Wayne's World. Uh, oh, yeah, by the way, uh, if you want to watch Clueless on Netflix, and I, I kind of give it a really, really fast uh, rating. I give it a... A 7 out of 10, because I like it, but then it's a girl kind of movie, so a lot of people won't like it, so it kind of depends on you. So that's why I give it a 7 out of 10. It's, it's, a, it's half. It's a good movie, in my opinion, but it's half good, because I don't know if it really depends on you or not, so whatever. Uh, like I said, next one is Wayne's World, which I think Lee, that was the last movie I saw, other than Vampire Night, because I was the show. Uh, Wayne's World is basically... Uh, let me check this, by the way. Uh, the other movie. Wayne's World... Du -du -du -du. Wayne's World! Wayne's World! Oh, okay, and now I know the other movie. I did watch it in the little one. So, Wayne's World. The first one. I've seen Wayne's World a couple times, but not in full. It's been like clips and fragments on like watching from like MTV when I had cable back then. And to like, I think VH1 had it or something. And then like just seeing it on like replays on some other channels or HBO or Stars or Cinemax, some shit like that. When I used to have to like, dish and direct TV and all that stuff. But I never really seen a full movie of Wayne's World. And I think I seen Wayne World, Wayne World 2. Wayne's World 2, sorry. But I'm not sure about that either. So I wanted to watch Wayne's World. Oh, I didn't rate that. I want to rate that. I want to rate that. No, 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 don't play the movie, don't play the movie, I'm trying to rate it. There you go. Alright, so Wayne's World, um, I really actually like the movie. Now, some things are a little outdated from some things they said, but hey, I like the funny humor because it reminds me of this, uh, a person I used to know in high school, I still kind of know him somewhat today, but I don't really talk to him as much, a friend in high school named Dallin. He's exactly like these two, like, no joke, it made me laugh, made me just, it's a good movie overall, I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10, the only big thing... I might have maybe hate about it. Um, I don't know. What? 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 what uh, I don't really know. <laughs> maybe they should have put like a. I, you know what? I don't know. Just I. I always just say ten out of ten, but that's has to be perfect. Perfect. I can't say it's my favorite movie of all time, so I'm just gonna give it like an. 8.5 or a 9 out of 10. That's what it is for me, my personal feelings. Uh, but it will make you laugh. Some things maybe, maybe it wasn't as funny. Maybe that's maybe that's it. But but it was really good in my opinion. So uh, yeah. And, and there's like a couple questions in my head I still want to know. Like how did they get the? How did they know all this stuff about things that they don't look all that smart? Of course they don't. But just a bunch of things about like technology. How did they get a broadcasting and other things like just just the kind of stuff I want to curious about. But hey, whatever. Uh, anyways, that's Wayne's World. And the last thing I saw today, uh, well, by movie-wise, uh, The Starving Games, which is basically a parody movie based on The Hunger Games. Uh, here, I'll show you what it looks like right now. The so Starving Games, right next to Wayne's World. And my cousin Valerie was watching Hercules, and his people was watching Clueless as well. Because, well, they're Clueless. So, The Starving Games. Basically, The Starving Games is, like I said, a parody of Hunger Games. It's basically... Everything you saw in the Hunger Games, but in a parody-like version of everything that year or past year that was popular or trending worldwide, like everyone knew about it, or or just something famous that hasn't really been established in the movie yet, or just something that you want to put in there, like like double rainbows. Even the annoying orange made the cameo in there, but not him actual self, but like a parody of himself, which is weird. Um, Fruit Ninja, the game, was a parody in there, same with Angry Birds. Uh, what else was it? a parody? Avatar, which I think like it was a movie that came out in like 2011, but it was in here. So, The Avengers, Expendables 2, uh, what else was in here? That was kind of a reference. Um, some actors were from some TV shows I've noticed, like, I, you know, I was, I've been watching Pretty Little Liars, uh, 
two, like, not, not two, one is basically in there, he's, like, the main character, PETA, and then, uh, the girl herself, that's actually, I can't remember the girl's name, but she's from, um, Corey in the house, she's that one girl, that's from that one country that no one knows, but it's a thing, but seriously, uh, the movie was okay, it, it didn't make me laugh, laugh, there was actually some moments that made me kind of like, uh, kind of nasty because they were doing things like eating wise or disgusting wise. But overall, there was some funny moments. But personally, I'll give it like a hmm, if if I gave Clueless a seven out of ten because of its thing, and this is, and I gave Wayne's World a, like a nine basically because of how funny it was and Starving Games, I'll probably give it like hmm, I don't even know exactly like six point three. Out of 10. Because that's what it feels. Or a 7. But I don't want to give it a 7. Because it doesn't feel like a 7. It could be a 7. But I don't know if it's a 7. I don't know. So that's my review on Starving Games. Uh, if you want to watch it. All three of these movies. Right now currently they're on uh, Netflix. Uh, just look up Wayne's Worlds, The Starving Games. And Clueless. In case you want to watch these three movies I watched today. And if you want to watch Vampire Night. Which is an anime I'm watching currently right now. Uh, you can also watch it on Netflix. Just look up Vampire Night or go to the anime section and you'll find it in Vampire Night. I'm hoping, but never know. Uh, anyways, uh, was that really it for today? I didn't play any games. I just wanted to watch TV because I wanted to have a day to catch up on some Netflix things I wanted to watch. And yes, I'll catch, I'll, I'll catch up back on YouTube stuff, but I want Netflix to get off there. Where the fuck is that? Hold on, we wind... The Paratripe is on Netflix. Oh, shit. That's something I need to watch. Do I need to watch it? Not really. Just something I want to watch. Um, anyways. Uh, Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. That's a classic that everyone should watch. I'll put that in my... Par oh, my God. Paris. But not Paris Hilton. Rugrats in Paris. Oh, my gosh. I'm on Netflix. I'm freaking out right now because all the movies. <gasps> Grand... Bad Grandpa Point Five. Oh shit, it's on here, dude. I remember my friend Anthony kept telling me to watch that movie. Mean Girls. Oh she snaps. I need to see that too. Mean Girls. What else is on here? War 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 Z. Oh my god, dude. What the freak have I been on Netflix? Brother Bear. Ah, uh, I've seen that movie before. It's not really that great. Um. Uh. Oh yeah, I wanted to watch uh Good Burger. What time is it? I can still watch Good Burger probably. Um. Let's see. Well, what else is on here before I get off? I'm on the popular on Netflix option right now, or section, or whatever. And yes, I... Oh, snaps! Do I have that? Do I have that? Do I have... Okay, yes, I do. Why did I freak out? Uh, I'm talking about Star Trek Into the Darkness. I've not seen that yet. Um, why do I sound like Yogi Bear? I don't know. Um, I feel weird talking like this, and you guys are just seeing me, and I'm just looking at the screen. Seeing what else is it? Sword and the Stone. Eh, this thing is okay. All right, back to Grandpa. Back to Middle Middle. Whatever. Okay, so uh, that's really it. I did not play, upload all day, watch the movies, and a show, anime show. And um, I've been talking to uh, a girl, which I like, and you know, all of you might know who that is already. But but I've been talking to her about all day. And I went to Walmart, bought some hot Cheetos and Takis, and we also went to Burger King, which I forgot to mention, which. Uh, I actually been craving that for a while, but I didn't tell my mom, but she wanted to get it too, so I was like, yay! So that's really it for today. Uh, thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe, leave a comment below, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for Back to Work Day. Oh, and also, GameStop uh, called my half, uh, house to tell me Tuesday will uh, One Piece Unlimited World Red or R is coming out. They didn't say the game, but I knew it was in that day. July 8th, but at least they called two days ahead, which is actually pretty neat. So thank you, GameStop. Anyways, uh, thank you for watching. If there's any movies you want me to watch on Netflix or shows, tell me right now in the comments section below, because I might give it a shot, because, you know, I'm, I, I'm, I'm someone that always likes watching stuff, or even if I feel like I'm busy doing, like, cleaning and writing and other things, multitasking, I like to actually hear things sometimes and actually stare at the screen and see what's happening, because I'm actually the kind of person that likes to multitask a lot. So once again, uh, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow or anything can happen in video game news, watching anime or anything on Netflix or my life. So thank you for watching. Yeah. Okay. Bye.